Hey guys, welcome back to Engineering Education. For this next problem, we are given a Boolean expression. Um, so f of abc is equal to abc naught plus a naught plus b naught plus a naught times c naught. And the problem is asking us to express that Boolean expression in terms of OR gates. And we're given here a multiple choice problem. It's one of these four. And we're also asked not to simplify. So I don't cancel out any terms and, um, you know, just, just try to keep everything um, unsimplified. So um, pause the video, give it a shot, and we'll go over it in a bit. So to solve this problem, we need De Morgan's Laws. Um, and we can find that in the FE handbook. So if we look at um, page 213 of the FE handbook, we are given De Morgan's laws here, uh, the first theorem and the second theorem, and we're going to utilize both of them. Um, so if we go back to our problem here, we want to turn um, this first expression from a multiplication problem to an addition problem. So recall that OR gates are associated with addition and AND gates are associated with, with multiplication. So we want to turn this all into an addition problem. And we also want to convert the third term here, um, also using De Morgan's Laws. So I'm going to copy De Morgan's Laws down here. So let's say we have this first theorem here is A plus B naught is equal to A naught times B naught. So that will help us with the third term, and the second theorem will help us with the first term of our expression. So going back, let's say we have a, b, c, not, and using De Morgan's laws, that is equal to um, a naught plus b naught plus c naught. And the second term of the expression is already in addition, so we don't need to, to do anything with that. And then we just want to convert the third term a naught, uh, c naught, and converting that using De Morgan's laws is a plus c naught. And then that's it. I mean, we, we combine the terms um, for the expression. So f of a, b, c is equal to a naught plus b naught plus c naught which is the first term, plus we leave the second term untouched. And then the last term, the third term, is just A plus C naught. And so we look at our, um, at our choices here in the multiple choice, and that corresponds to B. So that is our answer. And you can you can definitely simplify this. So if the problem's asking you to, you know, to simplify it, then you can cancel out a few things here. Um, for example, you can cancel out the B's here. Uh, B naught cancels out with B, and so on and for so forth. And you can continue, um, you know, simplifying it if need be. But that's how you go about it. Um, ho hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give a like, um, subscribe. And if there are any other videos that you'd like me to post, uh, leave me a comment below and um, we, can, we can address it and see if, it, if it's uh, something that we can do. Um, thanks for watching, guys. Until then, enjoy engineering.